Okay, I'm back up. Now that I left that that cliffhanger, yeah, your favorite, Tim Burton. Um, no, <laughs> no, <laughs> I, I'm just gonna go with no, no, it, 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 no blasphemy. Should we just send him over? I, 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 I don't want to elaborate. I just, you don't want to. No. <laughs> <laughs> you get in trouble when you talk about Tim Burton, huh? I do. Okay, yeah, I, I'm gonna vote no on it either. He won't go into it. I'll, I'll go in my opinion. Yeah, he's good at doing the dark stuff and the creative stuff, but it all looks the same and. I, I don't want Deadpool having feathers coming out of his suit or anything weird like that. Yeah, no, 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 no revisionist Deadpool. Yeah, I, I, and granted, Deadpool is off the wall, but he he's set to kind of normal background stuff, unless Daniel Way has him being a pirate, <laughs> which he's not anymore. He, he's not. I haven't picked up fourteen and fifteen yet, so I got to go read them. Two him. issues of being a pirate, he's done. Two. That was it. Yeah. Oh man, that that had potential too. If only someone else was writing it. So yeah, the yeah, blind I'm, navigator. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah, they, and they, I don't know. Uh, uh, okay, so now, we just, should we just go to the next one? We'll go to the next one. Yeah, screw Tim Burton. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah. Uh, Ed, Edward Wright, Edgar Wright, who did uh, Hot Fuzz and Shaun of the Dead, got three yes. votes. Uh, I I don't know. I think he's got the comedy down, certainly. Mm-hmm. Uh, I, again, I'm going to have to question his ability to do like really over the top action, not just like in hot fuzz where a gun yeah. shoots and like a, an explosion goes off. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Uh, Choreographed fights and action, I think is what I'm kind of getting at. Yeah. Yeah. I, and, and of course anyone who do, does it needs to not be able to do the, uh, the choppy filming stuff, which it, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I don't know. I, I can't think of a movie right offhand. Probably the transformers movies. Um, Oh, there was some movie. Oh, what was the movie I was watching the other day? Oh, fucking G.I. Joe, which I liked. I like G.I. Joe. I, I, I don't know if anyone knows my opinion on this yet, but I, I, I really liked G.I. Joe. Yeah. I, I enjoyed it. it. It surprised me how much I wound up enjoying that. Yeah, oh, same here. I, I was like, this movie's going to suck and I'm going to hate it. And I was like, this is yeah. fun. And, and, and real quick, side tangent. Speaking of G.I. Joe, J-Train, why doesn't Target sell any Marvel toys? I, every t- every time I go to my Marvel, all they have is like Spider Man stuff, or like a few, like only like one or two of the superhero squad. So J Train, I expect an answer. Why don't you they sell Marvel? Nice segue from GI Joe. I should have segued somewhere with uh, Dukes of Hazard. Yeah, Sorry. well, I thought I thought I thought I thought I thought th- 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 when you said <laughs> talking about, I I thought I thought you were gonna like say like one of the chicks should have been one of the chicks in something, or one of the characters should have been something in Deadpool. I thought it was gonna be a Deadpool thing. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just want to segue over to J Train. Oh, okay. uh, so so like I was saying, GI Joe. You have fucking Darth Maul playing Snake Eyes. You don't need the fucking camera shaking around the whole time while you're shooting at him doing stuff. Show him being a badass martial artist. And Which, just as a side note, um, when you have a character who wears a face mask and apparently has trouble breathing and you hear, <laughs> do not make him sound like Darth Vader. <laughs> and don't put lips on his fucking costume. Well, that's, that's Snake Eyes, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, that, was, that was weird. Yeah, yeah, that was odd. Okay, uh, n- should we go on or a little yeah, bit yeah, yeah, more? Okay, uh, Christopher Nolan. What has he done again? Uh, Batman. Night, Batman Begins. Yeah. Uh, the Prestige. Uh, I don't. I don't know. Can 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 he pull off comedy? No. No. Okay. Hey, I, 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 not, not 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 except for those like little quips he does. Yeah. Um. Have you? Have, who suggested him? I want names. Uh, like, really? Have you guys seen his stuff? Uh, like, like, do you want Deadpool <laughs> to be really dark and depressing? And <laughs> oh, you be there's a lot, and I think the I'm seeing a steady split between the uh, Deadpool fandom uh, between the guys who just love the funny stuff and the guys who really just want the funny dark stuff. I, I have no problem with funny dark stuff, but if you yeah. give this to Christopher Nolan, the whole thing is going to be Deadpool dealing with his cancer. That's going to be <laughs> it. <laughs> And to be fair, I think one of the guys who one of the guys who suggested was like, "Oh, and we should do Christopher Nolan, ha 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 ha." Oh, okay. But, but I put it in there. at least one of them. Two, there was two serious Christopher Nolans in there. All right, all right. All right next one, uh, Guillermo Guillermo del Toro. Yes. Hellboy? He did the Hellboys, right? One of the Hellboys. Yeah, he did the Hellboys and Pan, Pan's Labyrinth, and Hell or and Blade Two. Oh, he did Blade Two. Okay. Yeah, he did Blade Two. All right. uh, I'm not sure if he'd have any interest in doing this. He can't make any like really weird monsters. Well, if they cast Layback in it, he could do that. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Um, but he'd probably look all strange and weird. Yeah. And, and I, don't, I don't know. Everyone says, like, oh, we need Slayback. I was like, he was in one fucking miniseries. Yeah. Screw Slayback. Taskmaster. 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 Taskmaster's got to be in this movie. 
and, with, and with the booties and the gloves and the cape. Yeah. <laughs> I love that costume. The old one? Yeah, it's so oh, badass. I, I despise that one. I, I, it's okay, but I'm like, oh, look, it's Skeletor. <laughs> I know. It's so over-the-top ridiculous. I love it. It's like they took every single like bad feature from Marvel with the folded down boots and the giant gloves and the cape and the it's just so funny. Yeah. I love it. Maybe not maybe not for the right reasons. <laughs> I don't know. I just think the other one would speak better in a movie. And it makes them just look cooler. Oh, oh it, would, it would totally be better in the movie unless unless you're playing off as playing him off as comedy with that. Yeah. And and it, it, God forbid they do pool vision. It'd be a fun pool vision scene. Yeah, th- that would actually actually that would be really cool. Is yeah. if they pulled in Pool of Vision and like the Pool of Vision was like what it looks like in the comics. I, I wouldn't I wouldn't mind it if it's not him hallucinating. I think that's the thing that pisses me off about Pool of Vision. Like it, th- there's when he fought uh Bullseye right. in the Danaway run, which was actually a good run from Danaway, the whole Bullseye battle. I I really enjoyed it. Uh and there was some Pool of Vision in there when they were kids. And it makes it look like it's almost a flashback, but you can tell it's pool of vision. But it's not them. It's not played off like it's them hallucinating. And as soon as I got to that, I was like, you know, I don't mind it as much. The fact right. it was when he was having them hallucinating, like he was schizophrenic. How awesome! Would, how awesome would it, would it be if there was a scene in this movie where he's where it's pool of vision, and you just straight up see him in the costume, just normal Deadpool costume? That would be cool. Yeah. Well, but, I, but, uh, just, we're running long. You might want to move on. Shit. Okay. One. Uh, next one, Joss Whedon. Uh, which, who I actually threw my vote in for. I don't know if you. If, I, I, if I remember. Counts. Yeah, yeah, no, of course that one counts. There, there was two other people who called it, and actually, when you said Joss Whedon, the first time I went through it, because I actually a bunch of you guys, I went through and posted comments to all of your stuff, right. and then I, I hit send or post all or something like that, and I don't know it, for. Oh, it was, uh, it was during a, a YouTube update, so nothing posted. Yeah, I hate those. And so I was all frustrated, and then I just got lazy. And so when you did Joss Whedon, I was like, "Oh, that'd be fucking awesome!" But being that there's I, no, I, I don't think I don't think he'd do it. Yeah, and, and there's no major female role in it, so. I, I, well, 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 he could make one. Yeah, and, and cast Amy Acker in it. Yeah. Oh, totally. Yeah. I, I, th- I just listening to some of the commentaries on his other stuff. I think he seriously has the hots for her. I think he has so, a wife. That might be a problem. He, and yeah, that's the thing I always wonder about too, because he does have a wife, but it seems like he's seriously got the hots for her. And and I think I'm still bitter about them making a bigger deal about Fred's death than Cordelia's. So, Maybe but yeah, point. Joss Joss Whedon would be phenomenal because Joss Whedon always does. Yeah, and then he can do action and comedy. Exactly. Uh, next one with three votes, and the last person to get three votes was Nate. Yes, uh, I'm totally for that. It, yeah, me too. <laughs> All you got to do is point and go, guys. Point and go. <laughs> I'd have this thing done in a week and a half. What's my motivation for this scene? <laughs> Fucking kill me. Words, do it. Yeah, just just laugh. Say something funny. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do pull vision. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. All right. Uh, next one, Ryan Somer. I have no idea who that is. M- me neither. Let's just skip it. Okay, Steven Spielberg. These guys on pot. <laughs> Wait, what? I saw these guys on pot. He's never going to do this. Yeah, he, he would never touch that. There's uh, another one at the end. I'm like, he would never do this. Yeah, let's skip to that one real quick. Martin Scorsese. Yeah. No. no. <laughs> that it would wouldn't never ever happen. happen. Talk- Although his new film looks amazing. Shutter Island. Oh, I have uh, uh, oh, okay. well, When you see the trailer, just, just think in your head, because this is what I thought. Think Batman. Because when I saw that, I'm like, this could be a Batman movie. <laughs> Oh, is that the one with the uh... this crazy island where he goes to the with the crazy people and the? Oh yeah! Oh, that would be an awesome Batman movie. I'm like, this is Batman. He's in Arkham yeah. Asylum right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that's next. Just me. That's just you. Yeah. So next okay. we got uh, Takayashi Mike. No idea. Uh, Japanese guy supposedly does some good action stuff. Doesn't know if he can do uh, comedy. Terry Gilliman. Again, no idea. Shane Black. Yes. What did oh, you... I, sh- I should have picked him. I'm, I'm, all right, I'm taking Shane oh. Black as my pick. Okay. <laughs> no, no, no. I, I honestly, I don't think he'd do it. Um, mm. but, but, but he, he wrote the first two Lethal Weapons. Okay. He, he wrote Long Kiss Goodnight. He wrote Last Action Hero. Ooh. Yeah, and 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 he direct he wrote and directed uh Kiss Kiss Bang Bang, which no one else saw. Yeah, yeah, that, that uh, was but, one. I... But, but, well, uh, but but his uh, again, I don't know if he can do the over top over the top action. 
No idea. I haven't seen his work except for Last Action Hero. Well, if he did Last Action Hero. Yeah, but he didn't direct. He only wrote it. Oh, okay. Never mind. Okay, uh, next we have John McTiernan did the Predator movies and Die Hard movies. Um, I, I have to go with the same thing. Like, his the action is just, like, point and shoot. Mm-hmm. Deadpool needs swords. De- Deadpool needs, like, like kind of like Kung Fu, like John Woo-like action, but with swords. Yeah, yeah. With flipping and stuff. J.J. <laughs> Abrams? I don't think he uh, would touch it. I, I, I don't either. Yeah. Like, he's like, like supposedly he's he's a big geek, but as far as I know, he's tied up with Dark Tower right now, and yeah. and I'm not that impressed by his directing. Like 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 Star Trek was good and all, but I didn't see yeah. anything. Where I was like, wow. Yeah. He, he, I think I think JJ Abrams directs like you. Really? Yeah, you're really like if you ever if you ever looked at like aside from like lens flares, he it really looks like he just sits the camera there and is like go. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know, maybe that's just me. Yeah. 